Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be going over why your payment might be on hold with PayPal and then also what you can do to release payments that you have on hold. So first, I'm going to touch on why your payments might be on hold or unavailable. And I'll link these two help articles down in the video description if you'd like to check them out for yourself. So below are a few of the common reasons as to why funds might be on hold. So number one here, you're a new seller with PayPal, or you might be an established seller, but you have opened a new account. And if you're new to PayPal, it can take some time to build up a positive reputation as a seller. So essentially, PayPal puts these payments on hold just to confirm that you're a reputable dealer. And then once you've built up that reputation, then you shouldn't have to worry about this going into the future. Now, you might have built up a positive reputation as a seller, but maybe you haven't sold something in a while. And when your selling activity has been dormant for a long time, it will take time to rebuild this positive reputation as a seller. There also might be multiple customers that have recently reported problems or requested refunds. And of course, PayPal recommends working with customers to solve any problems. But if you have a buildup of reports coming against you as a seller, then that can also certainly be a reason why PayPal will hold your payments. You might also have displayed a recent selling pattern that appears to have changed or seems unusual compared to what you typically do when you're selling. And an unusual selling pattern can be things such as an unexpected large surge in your sales, a change in your type of business, or a change in the average selling price or the type of items that you're selling. And your payments could also be on hold if you're selling higher risk items. And high-risk items can include things such as event tickets, consumer electronics, travel packages, gift cards, things such as that. So these might be some of the reasons why your payments are on hold. Now I'm going to go over to the article to show you what you can do to try to release these payments that are on hold in a more timely manner. So if there aren't any issues with your transaction or account, the payment will be released 21 days after receipt. And you can help release these eligible payments earlier by following one of these steps below. So what you can do is print USPS or UPS shipping labels right through PayPal. And then they'll track the item and then release the payment one day after delivery has been successful. You can also add tracking yourself using one of the approved shipping carriers and adding tracking details on your activity page. And again, once you get a successful delivery with that tracking, then PayPal will release the hold one day after delivery. And if the held payment is for a service or intangible item, things such as, you know, a piano lesson, ebook, things such as that. So something that you're not going to be shipping directly to your customer. What you can do is update the order status on your activity page, and then PayPal will get you your money seven days after verification. And you can check out the order status and the activity page by clicking on these links in this article. And you also have the ability to add tracking details on the activity as well through these links on this help page. So I hope this video was helpful going over why you might have payments that are on hold or unavailable in your PayPal account and what you can do to try to release these payments that are on hold in a more timely manner. I'll link these two help articles down in the video description if you'd like to check them out for yourself. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel and I'll catch you back here next time.